I grew up in the Chicago area and um, actually went to school for art. Professional artist, it's kind of like my background, but um, it turned out that the 12 year long relationship that I was in, straight relationship wasn't gonna work out. So I figured out, was it straight? <laughs> Maybe it's just me, but growing up in, in the Midwest, like, having roots where you're at and with your family is such a thing. At least in my sphere of growing up, pulling them out and doing something different is like not demonized, but it's kind of unfathomable. And the big move first living in like my, you know, friend's back room for a while trying to figure out how to live as a separate person and then, and like figuring out this identity that I've never accepted before. That's kind of where I see the life where I'm at now kind of starting. When everything shut down, I also shut down and I couldn't make art. And like, I had commissions. I had, you know, these, these obligations. I needed to make money because I lost half my income. The first class that I showed up to it was drawing hands and I was blown away. I love the teacher and how she approached the class was there at the beginning. There was like a breathing, grounding. We are here right now. This might be the only time that you let go of your anxieties all week. So let's do that. And that in itself was my favorite part of the class. I. I drew, I drew in that class like I've never drawn before. The The way that class was is what kept me coming back every quarter. The stuff that I'm trying to do internally now is very much reflected in what I'm doing with my art in Path With Art. You're learning how to make actual art and then making actual art, which to me is creating something from you. Making art that is from you is itself healing especially having teachers that know how to bring that out like you can't get that in normal art classes i've noticed that i'm kinder to myself i guess which is very hard for me i've got a lot of baggage i come from a background where you are not taught to be kind to yourself so trying to be okay with myself and whatever i do is kind of the big struggle of my life and I've noticed that Path With Art has helped that. And I also, just as a person, am extremely isolated. I'm pretty much agoraphobic and even without that, extremely introverted. Coming out of lockdown and the pandemic, people are getting back to their lives and reconnecting and going and doing what they want to do and i'm still in my little cave watching everybody else leave um i at least have a sort of want to connect to people out there or a community or anything out there i have a, a little bit of a want which i did not have before so now as everybody's leaving i don't know if i want to follow but i don't want to lose everybody and I want to have some connections and put myself out there a little bit and I very much blame Path with Art for that. <laughs>